An Introductory Guide to EC3 Chapter 1. Welcome to Europol's European Cybercrime Centre, EC3 EC3 is the European Union central response to fighting cybercrime. The centre was established in January 2013 as part of Europol and operates from its headquarters in The Hague. EC3's mission is to protect EU citizens, businesses and governments from online crime. In the last decade, Europe has become a key target for cybercrime due to its advanced internet infrastructure and its internet-based economy and payment systems. Cybercrime's steady growth now means losses of 265 billion euros a year. The European Cybercrime Centre supports the EU member states in many ways. To do so, it divides its tasks between operations and strategy. On the operation side, EC3 works as three focal points, specialising in dedicated crime areas. FP Cyborg deals with a long list of high-tech crimes, such as phishing, junk email or website attacks. FP Terminal tackles payment fraud, and FP Twins works to combat online child sexual exploitation. Operations also works alongside the Cyber Intelligence Team, an analytical hub that collects and processes cybercrime-related information from public, private and open sources to identify emerging threats and patterns. In addition, there is the Joint Cybercrime Action Task Force, or JCAT, an operational investigative branch that examines the most important international cybercrime cases. It is composed of EC3 staff and cyber investigators from member states and non-EU partners like the United States, Canada, Colombia and Australia. EC3 strategy is divided into three teams. Forensic Expertise, which works with digital and document forensics and research and development to combat cybercrime. Outreach and Support, in charge of establishing and managing partnerships and coordinating prevention and awareness measures. And finally, Strategy and Development, that is involved in strategic analysis, formulation of policies and legislative measures, and development of standardised training. EC3 has had a challenging journey so far. Since its startup, the centre has supported over 70 high-profile cybercrime operations with almost 200 deployments of on-the-spot operational support and has analysed more than 800,000 malware files, 87% of which were malicious. EC3 has strengthened the EU's cybercrime fighting capabilities and our defences for a free, open and secure internet. You can discover more about Europol's European Cybercrime Centre and its teams in the following episodes.